Oh, that is awesome. There's the arch above the driveway and it has a porch. You like that? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> it's a sick house. That's nice. That's great. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this is kind of a tribute to my walk around. The guy who does the YouTube videos, he takes walks in neighborhoods. Uh, I first watched him do a turn through the beaches neighborhood of Toronto. This is Glenlock Farms. This is a community in the suburbs in Spring, Texas, northwest of Houston. And uh, we're going to take a little golf cart ride. My driver here, Julian. And our passenger, Marlo. Hi, Marlo. Hi. It's 6 p.m. on December 6th. Hey, Siri, what's the temperature right now? Go ahead. Okay. 57 degrees Fahrenheit, clear, 0% chance of rain. We got our sweaters on. Let's go, um, let's go down that way. We're going to start at the, uh, we're on North Point, and we're going to go down uh, Glenlock Farms, and we might look at some Christmas lights, and we might even look at a couple of home prices, pull up the, the uh, HAR app, H, Houston Association of Realtors. Um, there are no homes on this stretch. This is just the backs of other people's homes. Uh, we're just looking at the fences. Okay, we're at the corner of North Point and Glenlock Forest Drive. Go ahead and turn right here. And again, we're going down another thoroughfare where we're just looking at the backs of homes. They're, uh, uh, we have a brick wall. So that's how this guy does these, he does these walking tours. Yeah. And then he shows you on Google Maps, he goes, we're gonna start here. We're gonna go around here and then we're gonna end up here. Mm -hmm. And uh, anyway, he did this one in the Beaches neighborhood in Toronto. That, uh, Rambles through the neighborhood. Yeah, I really enjoyed it, so. Who's this guy waiting for? He's turning right. He's, we got nothing to do with us. Just keep on going straight. Just plow on down the street. There's this one house for sale. Uh, and there's this one street I want to go down that I think has some cool Christmas lights. Right. And then if uh, we'll, we'll try to go down the, that part of town where you like with the houses, with yeah. that architectural style that you like where the arched uh, um, port crochet over the driveway. Leads into a, another side of the house. Leads yeah. into a car park on the other side of the house, yeah. That part of the neighborhood's right up here, right? And uh, this is the golf course, and off uh, in the distance there is the this is the back of the house that looks out on the golf course. Would you, you like to go, uh, you down with it? Yeah, I'd be happy. Would you like to go down here? No, just keep going straight, baby. I don't. I'm sorry, baby, but your beverage doesn't fit in the cup holder. Is it empty, sweetheart? Did you finish it? Again, this is, um, that's the western sky. Sun just set about half an hour ago. And uh, these folks here, this is the backs of their homes facing uh, the, the, uh, the golf course. And so a lot of people decorate the backs of their homes here. Back where we began, there was a community playground and swimming pool. It's closed for the season. Coming up on another community playground and pond is up on the right. Again, okay, this is the Highlands neighborhood. And uh, that's not gated, but that's really back where all those homes we went past, that would be the entrance to that neighborhood. It's so dark. Yeah, the sun really only set like 40 odd minutes ago. Is that the neighborhood you like? I might be, I'm not so sure. Probably not. Say, the part of the neighborhood with the homes that you like? <laughs> yeah. I think I biked up here earlier. Here's the back of a really nice house. Let's go to the app and see. Uh, so, let's go to the our app, Houston Association of Realtors. Okay, yeah, so watch for cars coming up behind you, but at this stop sign, that's where you're going to be turning left. Mm -hmm. The rec center is only like a couple hundred feet. Uh, uh, 
so am I. Um, somebody spilled some bricks and, and uh, bricklaying materials there. Let's see. All right, come up here and turn right. This is it. I think this is it right here. Here, let me see. Hold on. I think it's this one right here. Let's Good. stop right here. Thank you. This house. This is one of the architectural styles that Julian likes a lot. It's the um, it's the arched uh, driveway. You drive under the arch. Okay, so this house is for sale. Okay, yeah, this is it. It's $504,900 American. Hey Siri, what's $504,900 American dollars in Canadian dollars? Here's what 645,000 Canadian gets you. 4,123 square feet, four bedrooms, three full and two half baths. So this one's vacant. So we're gonna peek in and take a little peek. Big, beautiful home. And, um, huge front porch it's got a three-car garage so you look at the garage you think it's only a two-car but one of these is two cars deep so cool all right so hey let's make a u-turn and oh let's go uh yeah let's make a u-turn and go down that way because there's more uh christmas lights that way Let's go all the way up there to the street sign to make the U-turn so I can show everybody this house up here. Mm, yeah, that's a cool house. Yeah, this house has got some pretty nice Christmas lights. And then farther down the street, they're all lit up. That's one of the gated portions of the neighborhood. Homes are bigger, closer to 6,000 square feet. Hey Siri, 4,123 square feet is how many square meters? 383 square meters. That's a pretty house with the white pillars. Yeah, the porch, the porch is nice. And the porte cochere. people they have a three car detached this is the one you like julian with the arched uh yeah. arched uh, yeah sweet See if there's any other houses for sale up in here. Now your part of town that you like is oh we're we're in a dead end up here. Yeah, let's go down here. Uh, uh all the way past that bald cypress. And then oh check this out. Check out this house here. This is nice. Good job, people. Look at the arch of Santa Claus. Oh, oh, that is awesome. There's the arch above the driveway and it has a porch. You like that? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> it's a sick house. That's nice. That's great. Okay, there's nothing else for sale down this way. Wow, look at the Christmas lights on this one. Yeah, let's go down to that Santa and make a U-turn. What do you mean Frosty? I mean Frosty. Wait, can we continue down the street? We can go down there and, yeah, sure. Oh, I like this, it's two colors, warm white and red. That's another one with a porch. It's one of your mom's favorite. Let's go all the way down to that one. Okay, that one might be my favorite. I like the porch, I like the brick, and I like uh, the arch above the driveway. Everything, it's beautiful. Yeah, that's, it's pretty cool house. It's an awesome house.
Oh, they don't have theirs lit up yet. This looks great. Nice and clean, warm white. All the lights are in one color. I thought we were going on that way. Oh. All right, let's get on here. Hi. What do you uh, see the exit through? I would say go straight. Oh, that's a dead end. <laughs> it is a dead, dead end, call. yeah. Although some of the coolest houses are on this couple sacks. Yeah. I would say no, I don't know the I don't know the exact age of these homes, but I'd say they're about 15 years old. Um, 20. Most of these homes were built in 2000. Get all the way over to the right, son. There we go. Got a porch and an arched entry. Awesome. Now, I don't really care for these, like the false carport in front of the garage that isn't big enough to park a whole car underneath. Yeah, keep going straight. There's going to be a home here that I want to take a quick look at. There's another arch. Oh, three are all arches. <laughs> it's three hundred and ninety-four thousand dollars. It's five bedrooms, three full and one half bath. It's four thousand thirty-four square feet. And it's wait a minute, this might be it. Hold on, stop right here. Uh let me see if this is it. I wish they had their Christmas lights up. Yeah, this is it. 1406 Hatchmere Place. Look at this pretty house. It's 4,034 square feet on a 12,899 square foot lot. As I said, it has five bedrooms, three full and one half bath, and it's 394,000 American. It's got this um, three car detached garage. And it's, I wish it was better lit. It's a really pretty house. You guys can go to the MLS and see it. What a pretty house. All right, let's go. Hey Siri, 394,000 American dollars is how many Canadian dollars? 394,000 dollars is 500,000 Where are we turning? Right. Five hundred and three thousand five hundred and seventy-five Canadian. Weren't we just here? Yeah, we were. That's where. That's the only way out of the neighborhood. Is basically pretty much to go back the way we came. All right, Jiggity Jane, we'll take you home now. It's getting chilly. Yeah, I like it. <laughs> it's nice. We don't, we don't get this very often in Texas. Hey Siri, what's the temperature right now? 47. 57. Hey Siri, 57 degrees Fahrenheit is how many degrees Celsius? Thirteen point nine degrees Celsius, December sixth. Hey Siri, what's the temperature in Toronto right now? <laughs> thirty degrees. <laughs> hey Siri, thirty degrees Fahrenheit is how many degrees Celsius? Zero, right? Minus one. Minus one point one. But it's minus one Celsius. It's thir uh, in, in Toronto, it's 13 Celsius here. Can you convert that to Fahrenheit? 
got 57 here, 30 there. Let's see. Two degrees below freezing. Yeah. I think the high there today was 37. Probably. Marla, you warm enough? I remember back in October when I was down at the river. Um, the one day it was a high of 34. Thirty-four was the high, you say? Yeah. And that was back in November. October. That was during a cold, a considerable cold snap. Yeah, it was the um, the week before Halloween when I was at the river last. It was the one day this year that I had to wear gloves. Okay, this won't be much of a detour. Just um, right up here. Oh, now your next right, turn right, and then make an immediate left. Still doesn't make it take any longer to get home, Marlo Jane. Yeah. In, into this neighborhood? Yeah. All right. Yeah, turn right here and then make an immediate left. Oh, cool. Oh. These are nice. Okay, turn left. All oh, these people are in the spirit of car coming. Another car coming. Hope it's not turning this way. Just get out in front of this Lexus here. This parked uh, whatever. That sorry, is. Subaru. And wait for me. sale rarely decorate for Christmas. Oh look at this pretty house. The way it's lit up. That uh, porch lighting. Oh yeah. Love it. Love it. Okay, make a uh, pull up in front of this house here. This house. Yeah, this baby. I believe this baby's been for sale for a long time. Alright ladies and gentlemen, let me show you this light nice house. Go ahead and stop. Thank you. Let me show you this nice house. This one's been on the market, sitting here for a while. 116 days. And what's cool about this house is it's 3,788 square feet. It's got six bedrooms, three full and one half bath. And it's only 389,000. And it's on a corner lot. Julian, get off the get out of the middle of the street, please. There's a car coming. I think he changed his mind. Anyway. Beautiful home. Corner lot. When this first one on the market they were living in, but they're gone now. The cool thing about this house is that its backyard is big enough for a pool. All right, let's take let's take Marlo home. You're doing a great job, son. All right. Thanks. Good, good decision hey, to wait for. I mean, hey, Dad. Yeah? What's F-Y-A-Y? It's yay, we're going home. What's L-L-A-L-L? -L -L? Laugh, 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 and laugh. Mom, it's yay. You know, in Spanish. Oh, because double L makes the yes sound in Spanish. You know how L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-L-
hundred to five hundred thousand dollar house neighborhood and they are 3,700 to 4,100 square feet. And this is our golf cart ride through Glenlock Farms. Oh, okay, sure. A lot of people still out walking their dogs. I mean, heck, it's only six. No, uh -uh. it's only six, six twenty-four. <laughs> it's not even seven o'clock, and it's already totally dark now. I don't think mom walks down here. Nah, she doesn't really walk down here. Is that Max? That's not Max. No. The dude walking him isn't tall enough for that to be Max. Wait, what time is it? Six twenty-four. Hey Siri, what time did the sun set in Toronto today? Sunset at 440. Oh, you guys need a bigger tree. <laughs> Ooh, I like this one. Yeah, a tree with the things not uh Don't you hook them? Okay, hold on. No, actually never mind, I don't got it. And there's a car trying to back out. Here you go, baby. There's a lot fewer people with Christmas decorations than I thought. There so would be the, uh, on this street. The golf car, uh, at some point, I don't remember. Well, let's see how much this one is. It has a pool. Hold on. Uh, you know, I, this pretty house here has a pool. It's 409000 is what they're asking for it. It's five bedrooms, four full baths, and it's 3,298 square feet. How many bedrooms? Five bedrooms and four full bathrooms. 3,298 square feet. And they're asking 409000 It's going good. I wish they had it better lit so that we could show off the house. Hi. All right, let's go. Thank you for stopping. You're welcome. So I guy who a lot of his home And we've made a full circle. We're back where we started. Yep. At the corner of uh, North Point and what's this? Sterling Manor. Sterling Manor, that's right. Well, thanks for watching.